Um, for those that don't know you, my name is Chris Nash. Uh, I'm the, as nicely mentioned by our host, uh, the newly elected uh, chair of the Australian Electric Vehicle Association. And uh, my first duty uh, is to present the Glen George Perpetual Trophy. Now, today's a bit of a special day because uh, we actually have the man himself here in the audience. So to help me present the trophy, can we please get a round of applause for uh, the legend who is Glen George? Come up, come up. Why is he a legend? Right, well, whilst he's, whilst he's coming up, so in 2011, um, and Glenn will tell you a little bit more about this, in 2011 uh, he took on a journey around Australia in an electric vehicle, starting in Perth and finishing in Perth. Glenn, would you like to elaborate? <clears throat> yes. Um, is it on? It's on. Yeah. Um, yes, uh, the AEVA actually was one of my sponsors for that trip. Uh, there was a, it wasn't originally planned as a trip around Australia, but it morphed into that. Um, and yes, uh, okay, that better. And um, yes, it took 73 days, but um, there were no real dramas. It was quite, I'd say uneventful. It was a very busy trip and we had, we had a lot of publicity, but the car performed. Um, there was no dramas. So um, yes, it was an excellent trip. And I, I wouldn't like to say I'd do it again. Uh, uh, this trip coming down here is enough, uh, but um, yes, it's, uh, it can be done and uh, there's no reason why anybody else can't where, do it. Where have you come from to get down here? Today, we, we, uh, we, Trevor and I came down from Mackay. Um, luckily, I came with Trevor because he was able to uh, assist me with charging because my batteries are very old and uh, it would have taken me about three weeks otherwise, but uh, coming with Trevor, I did it in six days. Uh, we did a fast DC DC charge from his vehicle to mine, every 70 k's. So um, yes, we did it in, in sort of record time actually. And so Glenn's come down in the MG, uh, which, which the MGTF, the uh, beautiful blue one, sitting uh, over there in the display area. Um, and that was the vehicle that you went around Australia in, yep. um, with your helmet and goggles and yep. all set up, looking looking a little bit like Biggles driving a car. Fantastic. Brilliant. So let me tell you a little bit about the trophy. Um, the Glen George Memorial, <laughs> perpetual, <laughs> perpetual trophy. <laughs> Don't have a heart attack now. My first aid's not up to date. Yeah. Um, perpetual trophy. Um, after Glen's uh, fantastic trip, um, we got this up and running three years ago and uh, using a very sophisticated calculation system, we uh, have been able to work out, based on the size of the battery pack, uh, based on um, how old the car is, so on and so forth, how many SID chrome spanners are in a toolkit that you bring with you and all this sort of stuff, we've been able to calculate uh, a points system for the distance travelled to reach the expo. And that is then presented as a trophy. You get to take home uh, this little trophy here. And um, funnily enough, for those people who like a bit of irony, our winner this year, travelling all the way from Mackay, is Mr Glenn George. Um, uh, okay, well, look, first of all, obviously having a, a trophy named after one is, is quite an honour. Um, to win it is, is really fantastic and I'm really chuffed. Um, I must say, though, I wouldn't have done it without him. I thank you for that, Trevor. I really do. But um, yes, I'm really, really pleased to win it. And uh, but uh, sorry, I can't do it for, ne for Melbourne next year. <laughs> he says that now. So, Glenn, this is um, this is the actual trophy that you get to take home. This is not the first time you've seen this trophy, is it? Uh, I only saw it for the first time about three weeks ago. Okay. Very good. Very good. So you've travelled down from Mackay. Now we should mention that Trevor actually won it last year. So you've enticed uh, you've enticed Glenn into uh, getting down and winning it this year. We have had our uh, national council meeting last night and uh, our national AGM this morning. 
It is also my great pleasure to announce the newest life member of the Australian Electric Vehicle Association and only our sixth life member also is Mr Glenn George. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, oh, uh, thank you very much. I'm really too, uh, yeah, I'm overwhelmed. So um, for those who... Um, probably don't understand the gravity of what Glenn did back in 2011 was um, really pioneering and groundbreaking for the electrical vehicle movement in Australia, disproving a lot of the naysayers around what was going on. Um, it was fantastic to uh, have him involved in that and as an association that really has given us a, um, a great footing to move forward to the position that we are now. Um, so there was a lot... Um, a lot of discussion, but uh, certainly no dissent within the vote this morning, and um, we're absolutely delighted to have Glenn as our uh, sixth life member. So, Glenn, welcome to the life members. So, I'm not sure whether that means this becomes memorial. Or, no, I'm just joking. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just joking. Um, congratulations. Um, Wrapped to have you on board. So now that you're a life member, that means you get instant in entry into the Melbourne Expo. And your car gets free entry into the Melbourne Expo. <laughs> Is this on camera? <laughs> we'll talk off camera. Yeah, <laughs> we'll talk off camera. Brilliant. Well, ladies and gentlemen, please, uh, one of the legends of the Australian electric vehicle scene, Mr. Glenn George. Thank you, Chris. Right on, mate. Thank you, Brilliant. Mate. No, and, and really. Membership for you. Yeah, no, really well deserved. So, um, delighted.